Hey guys, Tron Games here, and welcome back to the second episode. Now, as you saw, now as you saw in the last episode, we got ourselves situated with a nice little bit of gear and got ourselves a bit more familiar with this map. This map is insane size. It's pretty large. It's gonna take us a while to get around. So in this episode, I'm hoping uh, to find a vehicle, a car, so we could go around easier without, you know. Lose it without, you know, losing our legs. We literally run like a fat kid in PE class. But other than that, welcome back to Japan. Super good to be back. Super good. Now, like I said in last episode, we got gear. And now in this episode, I want to focus on exploring more of the map as well as finding the car. Shouldn't be too hard, right? Let's take a quick dive. So, apparently, I guess the series, the first episode kind of popped off a bit. I mean, we were shooting for 20 likes, but you guys were you're like, no, that's not good enough. 38 likes. That is 18 more than was necessary. That's amazing. That's really amazing. I'm so happy that people actually want to see more of this. I'm really glad you guys like this new map. If you, uh, I will always leave the uh, map workshop in the description if you guys do feel interested to play it yourselves. Right now, I'm just super thankful that we got so many likes. And also, we passed. 400 subs from the time of recording we are we were at 424 which if you think about it the time when i upload japan i had like three i had 396 i don't know what's going on but i kind of like it the channel's popping off lately and thanks to you guys that's what's been happening so thank you a lot for supporting these series and stuff it's super fun to explore a bunch of unturned maps like this elver Maybe we can even explore more maps that come out. More popular ones. What is this? A little villa- Oh! We're in a safe zone. Hopefully we can- I think- I'm, I did not even know there were NPCs on this map. That means they're a quest. That's pretty- That's actually really good. Really good. It gives us something to do. Like, I hope there's, like, quests, like, that you, like, that make you, like, you know, go all around the map. Because I'd just be super neat to uncover secrets and things like that. Barely had enough stamina to get over that bush. Oh, boy. Who are you? Hunter- Yumiko. Hi, my name is Yumiko. Welcome to the camp. Can I help you with something? Hey, we got a sport shot. Are you serious? Garbage, dude. Well, think about accepting your quest. Samurai Takahashi? Yes. Perfect. Nailed it. Greetings, fellow survivor. Perhaps you want to follow me to the way of the warrior. Yes, please, teach me. Heck yeah, man, we got a katana already. We already learned the ways of a warrior. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you want to teach me? Fine, teach me the ways of the samurai. Are you going to give me it back? All right, so basically, samurai, I don't know. I don't even care about pronouncing his name. I don't know. Literally took my katana and just said, uh, you know what? It's not about the sword. It's about your body. So basically, I now have to punch enemies. At least we kept this torch. Wait, why am I calling it like an English person? Flashlight. Medic. Tomo. Hi, do you need some medications? You know, why don't we just accept a bunch of other quests? Because then we don't need to come back and... Alright, well we need to find this guy some DK Pepper. Fast. He the mad scientist. We even got the coalition here. Interesting. Oh my gosh, man. Perfect setup. The tr the dual modder setup. Not as good as triple modder, but it is better than one. Botanist Nam Namiko. Why am I having... All right, we need to get this guy some seeds. It's quite an interesting area. This is like really, really nice buildings right here. Pretty, they have to be custom made. It really does bring the, uh, the Japanese essence to the map. General Koshiro. Hello, it's nice to see someone new. I'm General Koshiro in charge of this base. I am part of the coalition, an international group aimed at helping other survivors. What is your name? <laughs> well, of course, my name is Trend Games. I don't know if you have heard of me, but... Oh. Pl pleased to meet you, Trident Games. You're welcome. I'm sure you can help us in many ways. Just don't cause any troubles. Are there? I wonder if there's any different ranks. Nope, it's just like regular. Can I be one of your men? Alright, yeah, we need to rise up our reputation. Commander Nabuhisa. I'm very busy right now. If you need to talk, talk to General 
Kos uh, Koshiro. I will never be able to remember any of these names. No, my <laughs> no. Ah, uh, dumb zombie. Imagine being locked, idiot. We captured a zombie to let our scientists study. They say they are close to finding a cure. Ooh, he's in charge of the armory. Definitely accept that quest. We're not gonna be focusing on the quest yet, cause we need to, you know, we need to get ourselves, get ourselves on our feet as well. So, I'm thinking we could explore more of the map, find a car, build a base, probably get some more gear, and then we can help the, uh, these guys. If I do get the materials necessary to help everyone, I will, I will definitely come back here. But for now, it is not our primary focus. Hello, Mechanic Yozo. Car jack, blowtorch, and a socket wrench. Captain Sho- Show oh, ya, yeah. show sure, ya. Yeah. I. All right, let's see. A team of scavengers have uh, we sent to Fuko uh, Fukuoka. Yeah, Fukuoka recently reported the presence of a giant fire fire breathing zombie. Help us kill him so he can return to the city. I'm not gonna accept that because once I accept that, I'm gonna encounter a fire breathing zombie and most likely die. So yeah, we'll just leave that off till he can you know, get better gear. Hopefully we will. Is that a car? No, it's one of those broken down ones. What a prank. Oh, but there's a bicycle. Oh, what do you mean this thing doesn't knock? All right, so we can't stun the zombies, I guess, with a flashlight. Oh no, we have to do the actual power attack. That's annoying. Yeah, we need to find a new weapon ASAP. Kitchen knife is better than this torch. Why do I keep saying torch, man? I'm not English. Another practitioner, another gun store. Let's first hit up the practitioner. Finally, we found a kitchen knife. Get these guys out of here. You gotta be kidding me. Ooh, a suture kit. Very useful. Probably heal ourselves. We're at 47 health. Get nabbed by one of these dudes and we are gonna pass away. There we go. What the heck is that? Oh, it's a heat sim. Heat pack. Heat pack. It's packing heat, my dudes. I'm literally packing heat. Look at this. A med kit. Very good. A vaccine. Even better. The more the merrier. We're gonna have to get rid of some stuff and then take the med kit. Why'd I open that up? A aimbot client, aimbot client. Hopefully we can find ourselves a real good gun at this store. Get out of here. Honestly, I'd really, I'd, I would really like a sports shot. Nope, that's not what I meant to say. I'd really like an ace. An ace would be pretty cool. Combine these magazines. A full magazine. Seems we're at like a shipyard kind of. Shipyard and town type thing. We'll just ignore it. We'll just come back to this right now when we need the materials. Right now, we just need better clothes, bigger backpack, and a vehicle. Doesn't even hurt to check the fire station. We got a pretty nice fire truck, I must say. Battery's not gone. Has all its wheels. Probably should get out and fight off these zombies. You have some more experience. We should probably plop that into cardio and overkill. More damage with each swing. Right now, what's important is uh, to find a military location. Any good guns would help. I would go for anything. Let's just follow this giant road and see where it takes us. Going 62 kilometers per hour. Not bad, not bad. I wonder if there's a train here, since there's train tracks, and I think this is made this is made after Russia implemented their trains. I really hope there's a train. Imagine how fast we could go across the map. That, those trains can reach upwards of like hundreds of kilometers per hour. They also found also a new city. Wouldn't hurt to explore that hospital. Now would it? Ooh, and a police station. Oh gosh, not... This guy's on fire! Get the ambulance! Let's hope, let's hope that they give some good loot. Blunt force and viper mags. Interesting. We'll just drop that for now. Are there any shells? We only got like one shell within the... Oh, well, I mean, it's better having one. Oh, what is this? Transport heli. Oh my goodness. That is kind of good. We could definitely use that. A really nice helicopter. All right, let's get the fuel going. One thing that looks very interesting is all the vehicles look red or like darker than they should. That might just be me. That's just something I noticed. Fuel the car up, the fuel the heli up more efficiently. We don't want to lose gas in the air. Sneaking around in the hospital right now. Antibiotics, more antibiotic. Grab our suture kit. Quite a big hospital. I think this is, this is the uh, same asset as uh, Hawaii. Hawaii. Get an umbrella. Now the seeds one. We could probably grab some seeds and return back to that person. Let's see what quest it was. Determine botanist. Seed, lettuce, and tomato. We got all of them. Really good. Now that's a big office building. 36. 
We could probably spot a maybe a gas station or some place to refill our uh, refill our. This will definitely make traveling a lot easier. We are no longer bound to the rules of the road. Now we're in the sky. Sky high. Let's go this way. Wait, is this where? I think we already sent, uh, explored this time. Ooh, there's a gas station right there. Take a quick landing if we can. Look at that. Not even a scratch. Take some of that fuel. Put in here. Let's see if we can find a blowtorch. Ooh, binoculars. Use that for that other quest. Chemicals? I'll probably take those just in case. Let's fly out of here. I think right now what would be best is if we find a military base. That way we can get those smokes, better gear. We can complete that quest. This kind of looks like a military place. I mean, there's military buildings right here, I think. Little tents. See what they have to offer. Military bottoms. We need green smoke. What does it say right here? Coast Guard HQ. So this is probably the Japanese Coast Guard. Might find some good stuff here. I do not know. Ooh, a military knife. Definitely an upgrade from our regular kitchen knife. Nice, green smoke number one. Oh, we found another item for the quest. Oh, and more mil and more military knives. And now we can repair. Perfect. Was that a wheel? I think that's a wheel. That is a wheel. See, so we're in the uh, cafeteria area, maybe. Ooh, now we get some really guns. Kriz Krik. Kriz Krik. Or the, I think they're, yeah, in real life they're like Makarovs. Anything else? We'll just grab those, these pistols for just the sake of having them. Here, we'll just drop the blunt force. We really don't need it. Pick up this cruise correct. Drip it. The one shot's ahead, I think. For anything, really. Except those crawlers. F the crawlers. Look at that sunset. It's quite beautiful. I don't think we've been to this town before. It has a fire station, so we're probably gonna check it out and see if it has a gas mask. That gas mask is necessary for us getting really hi higher tier loot. Because I highly doubt that... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I highly doubt that, um... Gosh darn it, what am I, go what am I gonna say? I highly doubt that oil rig is the only place that has high tier loot. You gotta be kidding me. We got pranked so hard. I thought this is a real train that we could drive. No! Oh gosh, that's heartbreaking. Top 10 status anime monuments, maybe? Now let's check out the fire station. The gas mask would be nice. No gas mask. So no gas mask? Let's see what other locations we can find. A military base would be really nice, but probably probably not there. There seems to be so many secrets in this map. Like I have a feeling like there's just so much content jam packed that we you know we barely scratched the surface of. We got this place right here. Oh yeah, we were, we explored this place last episode. I remember that. Continue down this road. Whoa, what is that? Space needle? Space station maybe? Oh, another police station. We're just gonna give that a quick landing. So we can get some more gear. A bank as well. Hopefully find ourselves another katana so we can kill that stupid samurai who saw our first. <coughs> our melee magazine, dot site, that's pretty much it. Some okay stuff. <coughs> nope, we have been scammed. Big time. Uh, 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 uh. Now I want to see what is up with that space station. Just hope it is not a rad zone or radiation zone. Because that would kind of suck. So I'm just going to kind of fly at like a sideways angle in case... We do start to get radiation, then we can just zip it now our way out. I just have to find a decent place to land. I think right there. Perfect. Is that- Yes! We got a green- Oh, we got a GPS. I am thanking the gods right now. Alright, another note. Unidentified lights report. July 12th. It has been- is been- is now been two weeks since the green light appeared. The object is still hovering in low orbit. July 15th. Earlier this morning, the lights disappeared. We think it was shot down by a missile. We are currently triangulating the location of the crash. July 28th. We sent a research team in, uh, in Hakiado to study the subject. Where is Hakiado? Hakiado. Am I missing something right now? Either I'm blind or I just can't find it. Probably just blind. But I mean, hey, that GPS is definitely going to help us tons. Now here, I am just going to wait for a day. To come upon us and then we can continue on what is up guys it is morning and we are ready to get rolling let's grab our umbrella head down here head back to our helicopter and fly the heck out of here oh yeah look at this we've been here before in the first episode where we missed a little dinghy it takes so long to explore even by helicopter hello hello grand city wait that's a blimp that is kind of Cool though. 
You know, we'll just like get in. We'll just get in it so it doesn't despawn. And there's also a race car. All right, get to the blimp. Get in. And now I think it's saved. Oh, you absolute nerd. Incredibly relentless. All right, we need to find gas quickly. Oh, wait, there's a tank over there. Refuel. Is there a blowtorch? There is a blowtorch. Perfect. Now what we need to do is find another one, as well as a socket wrench and a car jack. We'll head over to this town because this thing looks chunky. Humongous, you could say. Hat chungus. It's fine. Wait, I saw a train over there. I need to, give the, I need to check that out. Please tell me we can drive this thing. Please? That is... Oh, oh, oh my goodness. We found ourselves a train, boys. Let's get in it. Can we even see the tracks on the map? They go all... Wait. Do they stretch out throughout the entire map? They do. They do. Oh, ho, ho. that's going to be helpful. We need to remember that train. We can just go so fast if we do cheat decide to to explore the whole map or go someplace far away we should probably build a base here that's what we should do once we do once we're done looting this place we should build a base you think in this <sighs> of course man we have to use the katana by like by law we have to use a katana while in japan always we're not gonna let that stupid samurai get the best of us smarter than him smarter than him of course i think we should lead the episode off here that we discovered so many things a new train we got ourselves a new pimp ride we explored so much more of the map i did not even know there was a space station till now so that's pretty cool we found the we found that area i think it's this uh area the shim the shim the shimogamo shrine like just think of all the things we could do on this map I'm really looking forward to uh, what this map has to offer us. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and bye!